Everybody hit the floor. Everybody hit the floor. Hey there, everyone. The Cell Cow playing Donkey Kong 64. And today on the menu, well, last time I unlocked the five gates of the Tri Path Igloo. So we're gonna start with that. Like, that's just a very obvious way to start, I feel like. And, uh,. After that, I don't know, we'll see how long that takes, and we'll see, and we'll see, and we'll adapt. Getting some ammo from around here, this fence is too powerful. How dare you show yourself in this night and day. There we go. There's the igloo. Yeah, five tunnels protected by five different instruments. Uh, I'm here with the sax, and so that's how we're gonna start. We're gonna go all around the world in 30 days, and look at that. Whoosh. That gate fell. It was like, well, I'm hearing saxophone. I'm convinced. Alright, there's one of these guys. Can I instrument? No, I cannot instrument anymore. Which is something, just a, a, a matter of fact of life that I'm learning to understand. Sorry about the pain there. I'm trying to hit that balloon. He is otherwise kind of mostly- Yay! That's a start. So, uh, let's see here. I could remove this and then just like chuck an orange at you. But you're not affected. Okay, I think a charge attack might hurt him. It does. Wow, that looks so unnatural. Alright, well, I'm not gonna complain. I'm gonna step on this thing. So what have I just done? There's bullets like just riddling the place everywhere. Okay, so this is a... Uh, whoa! You're spinning around at him. I'm trying to... Okay, I just hit a gong. Very exciting. He's stuck on the ice. What an idiot. Oh, well I'm flat now and I have little control over myself it feels like. Man, hitting this thing... Kind of not the easiest. I'm, like, I probably need to hit it like... Okay, so I'm gonna have to respawn the event. It's fine, it's fine. It doesn't matter. Oh, really? You get me to get out and come back, though? Like, that's just so... Ice physic is a thing. It, it might not look like it, but it's totally a thing. Really? And, okay, hit detection on that thing? Kind of weirdly precise. Like, I don't want to deal with this idiot, though, while I'm trying to land on a small target. Like, it's such a superfluous little detail that I just feel is not needed, one thing. Because I do not have enough time, so I'm just wasting time here. Yeah, I'm trying to take care of you, but it's not gonna be possible. Just kill me at this point, just kill me. I'm gonna start over with full health, like, at this point. I'm not gonna do it, because like... Uh, what? I... There's no solid... All right, you just hit it three times real quick, and there's a banana. We get to see that guy spin around real fast. Like, I knew it was just gonna be real quick once I did it. The reasons why it was hard is this guy just got in the way all the time. But I mean, that's his job. Like, I can't blame him for that. Oh, <laughs> here's the second banana fairy. Once again, taking great care to hide it really well. Like, the banana fairy is just feels so tacked on. Like, some of them have little clever places, but a lot of them boil down to, you got the banana here, so as an extra prize, here's a fairy that appeared. Gotta take her picture. You're dead, you took her picture. Wow. Good job, friend. Have a peanut butter sandwich. And I'm like, well, that's a pretty sweet prize, honestly. He's playing that wacky song, who knows? It's the only song he knows, so it was to be expected. He's bass are a big fan, though. Alright, let's go in the Siglu and see what happens. Okay, so you get more of a... There's beavers, so watch out. Okay, so that's... Alright, there are things around, such as pineapple pizza, a single banana. We're gonna hide a single banana here that you can miss. Okay, wow, you are just not making it up there, huh? 
There we go. This is very reminiscent to that time where I had to climb on treasure. Same sort of like awkwardness. Is there a banana there? I don't think so. Alright. Thank you, camera. You're pretty bad, honestly. Hey, we need these guys now instead of beavers. Look, I'm like completely ignoring you because I just want to get up here. Like, you are completely incidental to this challenge. No one cares about your presence here. I'm sorry that this is how you learn about it, but... Man, just get up there. Just, can you guys go away? Like, why are you even here? Wow, you're dead. It's like... What? What? Wait, that was a challenge? It was supposed to be a kill, the monster cha- Oh! It was a fluke that I managed to make my way up there. Whoops! <laughs> well, I guess that explains that. Huh. I was not ready for this revelation. Man, and here I was going like, You guys, why are you guys even here? Turns out, you're even here. To make this easier for me. Ah, uh, now I feel like a big jerk. Uh, I feel like I'm out of control. Yeah. Good times. Like, I mean, you saw the scene. Where was I in space? I, I, I'm... It's a, it's a problem with me in just 3D games in general. And, uh, this game is not the exception. Can you, like, just jump up there? Like, to the side a little bit. Thank you. Right, now well, let's carefully take our time to twist the camera. Is it gonna undo my twist the camera job? No, but like it's gonna like kind of fly off. There we go. You know what? That's what matters. Oh man, there's a balloon up there. Can I see the balloon from here? Yes. I'm not sure what I'm expecting. <laughs> That's what I'm expecting. <laughs> Alright, let's hope it's the only one. That is not the right control that came out. Oh, DD Kong. I'm sure to have some mean licks. Just the electric fryer. Your favorite instrument, and then we hear a wacky boing sound because the splat gets bop. Uh, what am I looking at here? Okay. But no, really, what am I looking at here? What? What is this for? So this is a memory game? Okay, well there's one. That looks like a three. That could be a two. No, that's a five. There's three. So is that two? Oh, jeez. Okay. Doesn't really look like it. So two. There's three. Four is over here. Uh, that's six. I, I, I have maybe time. Yay, I did it just last minute. The absolute lastest of possible minute. I've uncovered the very tenacious, powerful puzzle hidden within this room. The old lift the barrels in the right order according to the number that's underneath the pad. It's a, it's a classic. Classic coming of age story. Just throw my peanuts everywhere. Nothing matters. Oh my god, just kill the stupid balloon already. There we go. And uh, yeah, that's it. That was this room. There's a bunch of crystals here. Pretty awkward, honestly. They're just kind of there taunting me. DK Donkey Kong he plays the drum That's that that's a I pressed the wrong button. That's those are the two things associated with Donkey Kong. Standing on his drum is gonna break them. Like he is like he is very large individual simian. Alright, here's the banana bowl! Sweet. Oh, so it's a thorn maze of some kind. Alright, and that guy went, oh, and it's moving now. Oh, this is, at that time, will be had here, huh? 
Uh, am I supposed to be, like, in strong? What? Wow. One whole melon per hit? Or maybe. Okay, at least I restart here, though. This is giving me, like, you're supposed to use strong Kong vibe, especially with the crystals everywhere. Let's do a loop around the room, just in case. Hey, I'm not seeing any melons. Well, that's normal, but I'm not seeing any special barrels with my, my face on it either. Uh, the small banana seems to be, look at that. Wow, this, and you're on ice. This is pretty wild. Uh, like, this is a level beyond all the other Kongs yet in terms of complexity. What you're asking of here, it's interesting. Camera, ooh, the camera's spinning around like that. This may come as a shock, but did not help. Uh, probably did the exact opposite even. In mid-action, yeah, like, it completely. Like, I'm not sure- uh, For a while, and... Uh, it See, to me, it doesn't look like I'm touching that corner, like, at all. Okay, it's not a very long route, I have to say. Now, there's a part of me that wonders, did I miss a strange flat 2D banana amongst all of this? Like, it's extremely a possibility, it feels like. Because they exist. Ow, oh, just between the coconuts. No, okay, full banana, here we go. All disclosed. Yeah, no, I... I like this. I'm not sure about the execution, because to me it's not always, I don't know. I think it's just me in space being worst enemies. Alright, last, but extremely not least, it's Chucky Kong. He's a big guy. You can't jump good. Except if you want to go far, in which case, like, he might be a better pick than, like, have the cast. We're on the ice. You can see my there's a TNT man. Well, I don't know if the guy inside the TNT is happy being there. Oh, you know what? That's valid. So what's the? What am I doing here? Is that what we're doing? Because in that case, I'm gonna hold this so that I can then burp and destroy things at a distance. Well, at least that was the intent, but. It doesn't work as good as I thought it would at all. Alright, so we just punched the fires then. It's fine. They're pretty cool. And punching the explosion is fine as long as they don't explode. I don't know. Alright, sounds good. Something just happened. And a banana appeared. Let us not ask questions. It's probably better that way. Well, he's having fun. Who am I to remove that from him? Where's that spinning banini? I'm gonna shoot randomly here! And if you cross my path, that is your- Whoa. Then it stopped shooting, I think- There we go. Hey! Full banana count. We did it. Man, um... This feels weird. Okay, there's one more thing I want to do, so might as well do it. It's not part of the igloo, but it's something that I think should be done. So, a little extra bonus stuff. So right past this, past Monkey's Regency, there's the place where you put a thing, there's a tag barrel, but there's also a shrunk -a tonic a shrunk -a zone and next to a small tiny tunnel for tiny, and it's kind of like the last thing left to do on this side of stuff, so might as well do it now. Like, I've been meaning to get here a few times, but I just keep getting, like, the side route. Also, we can grab money while we're small, which makes it worth more money if it was realistic. That's not true at all. Alright, so I'm on this side of this tunnel now. Here's warp number four, which is stuff for tiny, DD, whatever. Yeah, oh. 
Well, there's a monkey port still, so I can do that, but okay. So that's pad number four. Do I know of pad number four? No, I have not found four yet, so... Ooh, something to remember then. I need to remember to get here once I have a four. Alright, I'm just gonna hit this thing eventually. This is the episode where I hit balloons. So, first... Whoa, my balloons are just going through my feathers. Like, look at that. Like, am I just misseeing? No, there we go. Alright, I already had your thing, so it's all good. But there is a port here. Maybe I'll... Oh, there we go. We get to explode this place. We don't even make it explode. We do get full purple bananas, though. So, there's a four pad somewhere in the world. Uh, I have to remember... When I find it, it's important, because this is important DD things. Alright, well, hey, there we go. Press the wrong start button. It's gonna happen. Okay, okay. See, even DK agrees, okay. sadly. Man, this went alright, because I just went to things, and we did things that was very basic and solid. I still think the weird layer rotato. Like, it's the camera. I think it's the camera. The fact that it moves while you're moving on ice within another polygon that moves, it's oof. It's like one one layer too many. Oh well, anyways, like whatever. Like I still had fun. Like who cares? 